Hello my beautiful Bitterroots and welcome to my channel and today I am doing a collaboration with Candy Powder and Blush. We have done multiple collaborations together and just because I love candy. I'll do, uh, yeah, I love candy. Anyway, this is the Summer Tag collab and I don't know, I kind of tweaked the questions like long ago but then I've just been kind of editing and that kind of stuff so I don't even know if these questions are remotely similar to the norm or what the deal is. I don't, I haven't seen any of the new summer tag questions or anything like that. So with that said, I'm having just a, a lazy hair day kind of deal. Um, with that said, let's go on to the questions. I have 15 questions here. Number one, my favorite eye look, which have to be this I look as of right now. Uh, I've been really enjoying a couple eyeshadows. So this is Makeup Geeks in the color Cupcake. And this one I use all the time and I've been using it as my transition shade. I don't know if you can tell, but I have a nice little dip going on in that pan. But I love Cupcake. Cupcake is absolutely beautiful. I don't know if you can see that. But this is what I have in my in my crease and then I've been wearing this one for my outer V is this Luxie in the number 290 so this is bit my outer V and then I just kind of blended it across and then for my eyelid I've been really 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 enjoying um, shimmer, shimmery um, lids. And so what I have all across my lid is this baby. This is Ofra Bliss. And as you can see, I've got a nice little dip in the corner of that. And Ofra's Bliss is absolutely amazing. You can use it for a highlight. I've been using it for an all over lid shade. And then what I do is I've been popping in this, um, this is Makeup Geek's Shimma Shimma. And I've been just popping this right in the middle of my eye. Like literally like right on, I swipe this across and I pop this like right directly in the center of my lid. Kind of like that. And that's my eye look for today. And this is what I've been wearing more than anything else lately, which is really strange because I like to switch up my eye looks but this eye look you guys have probably seen a lot ever since I finished off those um, one uh, that was in my project to use ever since I used those I've been really loving the Makeup Geek shadows the Luxie and the Ofra been really 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 enjoying those lately and I do like to mess around with color but for like my everyday everyday look this is what I've been doing. And then every once in a while, like once a week, I'll do a, a fun color in particular. Number two is lip color, which is what I'm wearing right now. I love the wheels of my chair keep bumping the tripod. Anyway, um, my favorite lip color are these bright pinks. I love them. As you will see, I wear a lot more pink in the summer <laughs> more than anything else. So right now what I have on my lips is this Milani in Blushing Beauty. I absolutely love it. This is in their regular line, but they changed the scent, so this one has the, the vanilla scent to it, but there's the swatch to that. I also have a couple others um, that I'll show you because I love wearing all different shades of pinks. Next one I have is this NYC in the color blue rose and this is an absolute beautiful beautiful blue based pink and it kind of has like a duo chromey like finish to it and I love it. Next thing I've been enjoying a lot this summer is Laka and Co Cheeky Lip and there's that. So as you can see you know I I am loving my pinks right now and the last one is the Stila and Bella and I love this one also. And there's that. So as you can see, I've got four different colors of ranges, all different 
all very, very different, but this is what I've been grabbing the most this summer. I don't know what it is, but I love wearing bold pink lips during the summer. Love it, love it, love it. The next one is nail color, and as you can see on my nails, pink. I don't know what it is. I don't know what it is, but pink is what I gravitate towards in the summer. But this is Julep's Polly. And isn't that just beautiful? I did do an Instagram shot of this, of my nails, and I absolutely love this. This was perfect in two coats or one really thick coat. <sighs> so beautiful. But the other one that I love, love, love during the summer, and I will continuously buy this product, is Julep's Cora. And as you can see, I've used this one a lot. So there's this, and I love it. It's my like mermaid one. Here is um, this one. I did all my nail swatches with two coats, but I like wearing this one in four. Two coats is great, but four just really gives it that really deep dimension and just gloriousness. It's amazing. It's amazing. So there is that I love 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 this okay number four my favorite blush and right now my favorite blush right now I've really been enjoying this makeup geek in XOXO blush it is absolutely beautiful and again it's a it's a the camera shows it more dull but it's more of a bright pink it is what I have on my cheeks right now disregard a lot of my redness going on here it's just my MS not being so nice to me this is so, it's almost like, it's so soft. It almost kind of reminds me of like a cream to powder finish. I mean, because it's that soft, but it's absolutely gorgeous. And I love this. Love it, love it, love it. So number five is favorite highlight. Now, I wasn't really into highlights for a long, long time, but I finally used up an Ulta one. And I pulled out my ColourPop one. And I have seriously been enjoying this. I don't know if you can see. Yeah, there we go. There's that highlight. How? So this is ColourPop in Stole the Show. This is been my favorite highlight this summer. It's gorgeous, gorgeous. So definitely recommend this baby. Number six, candle or scent. Now, right now, since I've been doing my candle thing, I haven't been buying um, my project candle I haven't been buying candles so um, I will show you a couple scentsy scents that I really really enjoy this one is in coconut lemongrass this is my second one shows you how much I love it oh it smells so good coconut lemongrass I love citrusy type scents in the summer in particular but this coconut lemongrass just screams summer and I'll insert the notes of what coconut lemongrass is it's so good and the other one that I've been enjoying is watermelon mint <sighs> oh my goodness screams summer to me also because I grow through different types of mint I use mint in a lot of stuff and I can eat my weight in watermelon in the summer yes I can so there's this oh and I was talking about my lip products but I forgot to show you my favorite lip liner in with those lips right now it's this Mally in frisky fuchsia and I am wearing this with what I'm wearing on my lips right now but it is a beautiful beautiful shade food my favorite summer food would have to be watermelon for sure. I could seriously eat my weight in watermelon. I love watermelon. Just top it with a little bit of sea salt and I can literally eat that the whole day and not eat anything else. And I'd be perfectly content with that. Yes, I would. My favorite summer drink. Now my favorite summer drink is sun tea, unsweetened sun tea. And this is what I've been doing. This is kind of my sun tea right now. It's a green tea. I love it. I'll tell you exactly what I did to make this. I get myself a drink okay so what I did is I added two of these green tea super fruit this one's decaffeinated um, this one's blackberry and pomegranate added two of those 
or no, three of those. And then I added three of these green tea super fruit, acai, dragon fruit, and melon. So my sun tea is acai, dragon fruit, melon, blackberry, and pomegranate. And then I added mint to it. I went out and picked a few um, sprigs of uh, my spearmint. I kind of crushed it in my hands a bit and then threw it in my sun tea jar and let it all brew together. And I've been drinking sun tea I drink sun tea almost as much as I drink water, and I drink half my body weight in water. <sighs> it's bad. But it's good because it's unsweetened. It's green tea because green tea is good for you. And it's really, really good. It's really, really good. And I, I just, I, I could, mm hmm, yeah. Mm -hmm. Unsweetened. Mm hmm. My favorite accessory. And right now it is these knockaround sunnies. I received this in one of my birch box limited edition boxes, and I've been obsessed with these sunnies. All my other sunglasses have been collecting dust ever since I got these. Oh yeah. Mm-hmm. I love these. I love these. I love these. I love these. Mm-hmm. I love things. Yeah. My favorite accessory. As yet. The, I mean, literally, I've been completely neglecting all my other sunglasses. Okay, number 10. My favorite movie or TV show. And I'm going to go with TV show. And I'm a big, big brother fan. Big, 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 big brother fan. This isn't going to be uploaded till July 1st. And today is... June 21st, so Big Brother premieres tomorrow. Tomorrow, tomorrow, I love you, tomorrow. I'm a big, big, big Big Brother fan. And I also watch Big Brother from other countries. I love Big Brother Canada because it's most like ours. And I loved Big Brother Australia, loved Big Brother Australia, but they canceled it. And then there's Big Brother UK. And I used to watch that, but now Big Brother UK is getting really raunchy and gross and nakedness and I just, no, no. So I stopped watching it. So now it's basically just Big Brother US and Big Brother Canada that I watch. <sighs> I'm so sad about Big Brother Australia. But last season of Big Brother Canada, Tim from Big Brother Australia was on the show. He got pretty darn far in the, in that season, so I was super excited that Tim was on the show because he was my favorite, and I'm glad he won Australia. So, on to, that was a big rant. Question 11, outdoor activity. What I love to do in the summer is biking with my kids. We've been doing 10 to 12 mile bike rides, and I love hiking. I just love being out in the mountains and being just away from people and just enjoying God's creation all around me. Number 12, vacation. Um, this summer we are going to Glacier National Park and spending a week up there. So we're going to be doing a lot more hiking up in there. Um, last time I was there I was 45 pounds heavier and so I wasn't able to do as many hikes but this year we are going to go all out and do as much hikes as possible and see as many waterfalls as we possibly can hike to. That's our goal for this year. So 13 favorite tra tradition, summer tradition and of course you know we all love 4th of July but you know I'm kind of burn out on 4th of July. I, I just want to run away into the mountains during that time. Anyway, but my favorite tradition is in the summer we hike to waterfalls and we love hiking to waterfalls. We try to do it as much as we can. We try to see at minimum at least three waterfalls a year or that a summer. But um, oh and then we're also wanting to bike the Hiawatha which I think is 11 or 13 miles that you bike somewhere in there, but we want to do that sometime this summer, but this summer I am so extremely busy. <sighs> so extremely busy. So, 14, my favorite decor item. I don't really decorate to the seasons 
I really don't. The only time I ever really decorate is Christmas. That's the only one I really care for. And so I guess the only thing I love having fruit out. I love having fruit out. So I, I guess I don't know if you would call that a decor item or what, but I don't really, I don't decorate to the seasons. Christmas is, I decorate to the fullest during Christmas. Yes, I do. And 15, favorite thing about summer. And I'm not the biggest fan of the heat, hence, because the MS just freaks out on me. I, I start walking bad. My walking gets affected greatly during the summer. So I am walking the half marathon, but just pray, pray, pray that my walking stays good. I will probably um, pack a folding cane just in case um, my walking starts getting really bad. We walk in the morning, but the heat can really kick up really early and we have a dry heat. And so, um, yeah, I think I'm going to get like a little folding wa uh, cane or a folding walking stick or just something to that extent just in case because I the last thing I need to do is be falling while I'm doing the half marathon. So, yeah, that is my 15 questions. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I will leave Candy's link down below so you can see all of her summer favorites and, and all that stuff. And I hope you guys enjoyed this and see you guys in my next video. Bye!